Our senior design project encompasses a 3D printed force sensor insole. So basically what we want to do is read the various forces in a person's foot. We 3D print the actual insole as well as the circuitry within it to gauge the forces that are being applied to it. That way we can work with possibly physical therapists in rehabilitation settings or physicians. That way they can get a better understanding as you're going through the rehabilitation process. Our goal is to try to develop a valuable device to help the patient of the recovery from the skeleton injury. Previously, we used this commercial, this kind of this force sensor, and now we're going to move to the 3D technology to build this kind of force sensors. 3D printing, you know, has the beauty of uh, customization. So basically, you know, we want to personalize this device and it fits our particular needs. What we are doing here is designing a printer circuit board for the 3D printer uh, sensor rate. Uh, use this uh, sensor data send it to the, uh, through Bluetooth to our smartphone application and check the position of the sensor. Originally, this project started with data being transmitted from one sensor, and that data would be transmitted to an Android device and charted over time. So we're completely redesigning that project to accept an array of sensors and display the data on an Android device in ways that anybody could understand. What we're doing here is we're 3D printing four sensing resistors and we're using the next level where we're incorporating two different types of materials. So typically a 3D printer has FDM, so it's a filament deposit. But we also have with our printer, uh, it's a silver conductive ink. And what that ink does, it's capable of carrying a charge. So what we're doing is 3D printing our wires in with the structure of the footbed itself. And then from that, we're able to encapsulate everything in a, in a single assembly. So everything is isolated and not necessarily broken apart or assembled in multiple pieces. As we have it right now, the insole and the data that we acquire from it is sent to a single Android device. I think a future iteration for this would be to send it to a server application so that this server application could be accessed by physical therapists, physicians, being able to read data that the patients are actually recording on a daily basis. So they can go in remotely and access the data and see how they're recovering in the rehabilitation process as opposed to just going in every day, every week, every two weeks. A physician or a physical therapist can go in there and just remotely access the data and then verify that everything's going well or not going well. So they're able to see and aid the patient in that way.